channel. I'm Magnific. And this is Magnific Keys kind of feed. If you're just tuning in or joining my channel, I'd like to say thank you and hit the like and subscribe button if you haven't joined my channel yet. Today we're going to talk about a topic that I've seen uh, uh, around or, or questions that's um, been posted in, in on different platforms asking the question, um, what would you do with your comics after you're gone? Or what are you planning to do with your comics before you're gone? Or your collectible, anything you collect. So we're going to touch on that topic, uh, so stay tuned. Okay, guys, welcome back. Um, the first thing I want to do is I want to say welcome, welcome to Magnific Comics feed. I took a couple weeks off because I wasn't feeling too well, but that doesn't mean something else got stopped, other than the content I'm putting out. I had to go to keep on doing things besides creating content even though I was being run to the ground for better terms of words but in this topic I want to talk about uh, well I've seen this post online well, it was on uh, Facebook and uh, one of the in the community comic community a question was asked um, what are the comic collectors out there are planning to do with their comic books before they pass right before they die or where do they expect their comics to go uh, or do they have plans or, or something set in stone or in place of what to do to their stuff or collector as a collector before um, if something were to happen to them, right? I haven't got that far in my um, with with my my journey with my journey of collecting as well as uh well you know selling us also buying same thing as collecting either or I, I haven't got to that to that point yet, right? So. But what did dawn on me, as I sat back a couple of days thinking about this, I have a very interesting take on what could happen. <laughs> um, so, I'm thinking this video is going to be called Digital Versus Physical. Digital versus physical collecting comics. So, I didn't break this thing down in segments, but because I'm, you know, I'm excited, I'm bad, I'm just trying to fly through um, and, and give some feedback on what I think could possibly happen if, if, if uh, that question I mentioned will, um, will pose a different way. But, so the question was like, what would you do? with your collection if if something were to happen to you do you have something in place say that it may go to someone else or something if something were to lord forbid happens to you right so <clears throat> this is i might go all the way left with it right so um if i'm sounding crazy stop me you know what i'm saying but i honestly think um Here's the thing, the, 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 I think what's going to happen is, you probably, 
I, I could probably answer that question and probably help a lot of people with that question based on um, what I'm about to tell you. So, here's the thing what I think is going to happen, right? Now, for the people that might might be thinking about what they're going to do before they pass or whatever, maybe for them or even for, I mean, you just never know anyone, you know, even me, you know, something happened with, or forbid, where, you know, where's my stuff going to go to, right? So, see, but let's talk, let's take this a little further out, right? I wanted to take this topic a little further out and say, what, um, I don't know if this is happening, but I'm pretty sure it could. Maybe I might be inventing it as I'm talking to you. So, I'm thinking... You don't have to probably die with your collection, right? You know what I'm saying? Like, I was thinking, <laughs> the, the thing that you have, right? far as collectors, right? Some people are f have physical copies of things with, which, which makes it a collection, right? And some people store their items or, or their, you know, their collection on the digital platform, right? So, if you think about it in the near future, maybe even far out in the future, where your kids or even, you know, um, hell man, if you might live to see that, um, to where you they might you could probably keep your collection on in the digital world as well as um, you also be put into the digital world as well to uh, stay with your you know to do what you love to do as far as with your books so now what I mean by that is that everything is moving so towards technology that even if you pass or you die physically there may be something that someone out there in the universe may be working on that uploads your conscious or whatever you want to call it I might just be going out far it's not like some comic book shit already but where they can upload your consciousness so that you're, you can be also placed be placed into the digital world as well Meaning that if your if your collection are in are, are transferred onto a digital world, you will be you also and you as well, as far as your consciousness plugged into a digital world, then you won't have to be separated from your collection because you you'll do you'll be with the collection in that world, right? That's just some I'm, I'm I'm thinking I'm guessing. It might happen somewhere down. I might not even be around to see it. So I just wanted to come on here and say, hey, that's just it's just an idea, you know, of probably what, you know, if people are worried, maybe for the younger generations are worried about, or, you know, even for yourself, depending on how fast they make it. I don't know. Because some people don't want to separate from their collection sometimes, man. Some people just, you know, they want to, hang on to it even after life, man. And, I mean, when I looked at some answers as far as that question on the platform, some people were like, hey, man, I'll give it to her. You know, I told my wife, etc., what to do with the kids. And I told my, you know, I wrote it out in my will. Who goes, what portion goes to I mean, a whole bunch of answers. And it's not one thing, you know what I mean? It's one thing at all. It's just a bunch of Good, good answers, you know. What you know, some people want to give it, give it up for free, and some people want to. Some people even said they want to keep it. They don't care. Uh, what I mean is like they won't care what they do after they're gone, cause they're gone. So who cares what happens to it, right? Those were some of the answers I've saw in there as well. But I believe somewhere in the near future, you know, for collection collectors, maybe younger collectors, 
a lot of this thing might be moved on to these uh, to the digital realm to where you know um, AI and all of that stuff uh, so you might not you know you might they might upload you somewhere <laughs> matter of fact <laughs> You guys need to watch uh, this uh, thing on Amazon Prime. I don't know if you've seen it, but it's called actually called Upload. But you know what I'm saying. So if you're that serious about your collection and you don't want to part with it, you know, uploading might be the thing for you. You dig? You know what I'm saying? When they gonna come with it, who knows? But <laughs> you know what I mean. For me, it's not that serious. You know, <laughs> I'm just giving, telling you guys. You know, far as people who saying they wanna, you know, piggybacking off my man Reg. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? If you wanna retire from it from comics, you know, you could do that. Or <laughs> you know, but they will probably have something where they can upload you into the digital world to where you may actually be able to stay with your joint and you can enjoy reading it as much as you like. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You no know, who knows? It probably makes something where, you know, it, let me tell you, it might be a little scary for some people, man, right, to, to know that you're not there in the physical, but then, you know, you, you know, you, you, your, your others that you left behind, such as your kids and your wife, walk into a room and there goes your, your AI, right, in a digital form, standing there doing the things that you were doing before you left, right? That, that, that could be scary, but it's just, I'm just telling you. Uh, technology is funny, man, so you never know where, how far they could take this, man, and that could do anything, not just with collection or anything, so, just telling you, I've also already thought about creating something, um, not in that realm, but something, uh, that's more devastating that you could probably be, <laughs> could ever imagine, you understand, so, but I'm not gonna share that here, <laughs> because I'm pretty sure someone will be knocking on my door. <laughs> if I mention what I know on this platform, okay? So, we just gonna wrap it up like that, man. So, I, again, you know, digital, physical, you know what I mean? What you gonna do when you retire, or what you gonna do with your comics uh, when you uh, before you pass on and stuff, you know what I'm saying? Who knows? I, get, I gave you some, some feedback on what I think could be a possibility to where you don't have to part with your comics you can just get uploaded with the comics into the digital world trust me they have stuff like that <laughs> and that's for real so anyway man thank you for sh showing me love um you know what if i can reach 100 subscribers man i'll give i'm giving away come on let's do this I was gonna spin and do some some games with it to see if you guys any of my any of my kung fu heads is out there. You know what I'm saying? So let's see. So we could do this. We could do this, right? Um, wait. One second. My next, if I get a hundred subscribers, I'll be giving away some treats, right? Get that for you. Can't find some of the stuff on the ad, but anyway, so. Anyway, it's going to be a book. I'm going to be giving away. I'm going to be giving away a book. A good comic book. I can't show it. I don't know. I have to find it. But it's going to be a good book that I'm going to just uh, throw in the box. You know, if I get my first 100 subscribers. Right? So I'm going to be giving away this movie right here. Underworld. You know who she is. The one and only. The Miss Beautiful. Kate Becker. See her. You know who that is. Right? And um, probably a copy of the Young Master, Jackie Chan, the Young Master, right? I'm gonna 
give away a copy of that and a copy of this Underwear Evolution along with a, a free comic book. I haven't found it, but I'll tell you what it is on the next video. Alright, so stay tuned and um, again, enjoy. Peace.